everyone welcome to the vlog 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 um it's just me today and it's a solo vlog for a tattoo adventure yes and due to the uh panorama or whatever you want to call it the way of the world i have to be alone for this appointment i can't have a support person which um would normally be whitney but um it's gonna be just me so um but the good thing is i'm going to a shop i have already been to which is helpful and i'm seeing the shop owner who i've never had before but um i'm pretty pleased with the his work i looked it up and because i watch ink master obviously i'm a know-it-all <laughs> and um, i like his line work and i'm pretty okay with it i'm just really nervous because i've never had a tattoo on my foot which is where i'm gonna get it I have uh, 10 other tattoos. This is not my first tattoo. It'll be my 11th. So I'm not that nervous. It's just the location making me nervous. So um, again, this is the shop I went to where I got my Tinkerbell tattoo on my inner ankle and my Mickey and Minnie tattoo on my other inner ankle. Um, I don't know if you guys know, I have three Disney tattoos and seven Katy Perry related tattoos. Um, yeah, that's right, you guys. I'm a badass, really. So today will be my first Demi Lovato related tattoo. I'm going to be getting a Nightingale bird on my foot for her song Nightingale off of her album Demi, which is not the new album. It's actually a really old album, but it's still my favorite song. It's been my favorite song for a long time. So I'm like, this is it. When you have a favorite song, you just know, right, you guys? That's I mean, that's all my other Katy Perry tattoos are. They're my favorite songs off of her albums, actually. Um, let me do a little tour real quick. Hold on. So this beauty is off of her song, Teenage Dream. It was my first one I ever got. I got it the day after I met her. See that picture? Yeah, yeah. That's what that's from. This was my second one. This is unconditionally off of her third album, Prism. I got that because that song just made me feel so loved and happy inside my heart. I'm like, I have to have it on my body. And then I went and got her song, I'm Still Breathing, which is off her first album, One of the Boys. It's one of the best songs on the album. If you haven't heard it, go ahead and listen to it. And then I got Pendulum off of her fourth album, um, Witness. So this song is really uplifting and fun. And it says, your highs, your lows, just write it. And then I got victory is in my veins which is a line from her song rise which is not on an album it was just a song she sang for the olympics so i was like yes this is amazing and then i got a little matching baby with her for her song never really over so she has one that says miss and a bunch of our kitty cats got one that says you so we all match each other when we put our hands together and then my recent most Katy perry one is i am resilient Learn to be brilliant off of her album Smile. Right there. Smile. So, yes. Clearly, my Katy cap shines high because I have seven Katy Perry tattoos. And I will continue to get Katy Perry tattoos until I'm out of room, which my arms are for Katy, is what I always say. <laughs> So yeah, I am running out of real estate on my body, which is why I'm choosing to get one on my foot. Because I am a plus size person, I have to be careful where I get tattoos because I have like fatty areas and stretch marks and that can blow a line. And I don't want to have Mickey tattoos, I, mucky tattoos. I want to have tattoos that like will look nice and last a while. So yes, I hope you guys are ready for this journey. Again, first time on my foot, I might cry a little, but I'm not going to scream because I'm not a baby bitch it'll be fine see ya oh wait i thought i'd give you a little tattoo advice really quick in my past experiences things i've done to prepare myself is i drink some water eat a small meal and i be sure to remember in my head that yeah this is about to hurt because it's don't fool yourself it is going to hurt it is someone taking needles to your skin and basically just cutting you a thousand times it's gonna hurt no matter how much you think it's not so prepare yourself <laughs> here we go here we are in the room. <laughs> All this nice art. Look at that giant ship. That's this stencil. Perfect. We're just doing this black and white, right? Yes, sir. Yes. Hello. <laughs>
there. There's the outline. We've made it this far. It did shake quite a bit, the poor guy. <laughs> but he was just holding my foot still there. <laughs> and they kept saying, it's spicy. <laughs> Alright guys, we're all done. I'm not gonna lie, that was the most painful one I've ever had. And I did shake a little bit, but he was so cool about it. He was like, just take a breath. And he was playing these videos of this um, band, or sorry, this group of people who go around the world and they find other musical artists and they videotape them. So we were watching that to distract me, which is nice. But you know, here, here she is. My little nightingale bird. And now I'm gonna go get some food and I'm gonna go home. Woo! All right, everybody, it's a few hours later and I've already taken the bandage off and given it a little rinsey rinse. Here she is a few hours later, looking nice. There's Mickey and Minnie, Tinkerbell, and on this side over here is my evil queen. So they're all just nice. It does still hurt, I'm not gonna lie. And they told me to prop my foot up, so I have all these pillows here. Thank you for joining me so much on my tattoo adventure today and hopefully our next vlog is me and Winnie together and again thanks for watching don't forget to hit subscribe